Hey guys, thank you for tuning in to Mumu Outdoors. Today, I'm going to give you a review of my new favorite fishing jacket. This one is made by AFCO. So this is a basically a windproof hoodie. So this jacket was actually gifted uh, from my good buddy Mike. Uh, he was actually getting one for himself and he thought of me, uh, what a nice guy, and he got me this jacket. And I've been wearing it since last December and uh, I absolutely love it. As you know, I like to do a product review when I come across a really good product. First of all, this jacket is $99, um, so it's not cheap, uh, but it's not too expensive either. Actually, with all the features and the quality of the jacket, I think $99 is a really good deal. Like I said, this is a windproof, uh, water resistant. This is very warm as well. So as you know, up in NorCal, uh, out in the coast, out in the ocean, um, it can get chilly uh, even during the summertime uh, when the wind picks up. What I've been wearing is this guy right here. This is an NRS paddling jacket. Uh, this thing is waterproof, so I love it when it rains. However, the downside about the uh, waterproof jackets are they're not very breathable. I know most of the manufacturers claim that they are breathable. They are breathable somewhat. When it comes to like waterproof material, uh, they're not as breathable as other materials. And uh, a lot of times the problem I have with this jacket, this uh, paddling jacket is it really really keeps the water out and you know, it's obviously it's really really good windproof jacket but sometimes I get hot sometimes I paddle hard or paddle hard and I sweat and uh, I pretty much kind of stay wet inside with this guy I never actually stay wet inside it's actually very very breathable some of the feature uh, that's this one helps breathe better is the ventilation underneath the armpit right here that helps a lot and this is a pretty warm jacket so sometimes when you get a little too hot you can unzip the side and let the air in to keep you cool and this zipper right here this side zipper right here actually does two things and it also makes it easier when you are putting it on and then taking it off as well. So during the winter time when it's really cold and uh, when it gets really windy or when you are fishing out of a boat, power boat, you are driving your boat 25 miles per hour so you got that 25 mile hour wind and it really really does a good job uh, blocking the wind. On a really really cold day uh, under this jacket, I wear this uh, nice and warm fleece shirt and uh, my, my typical underlayment uh, underneath the shirt. Uh, I actually have a video on you know what I wear in different types of water, different types of weather, uh, whether it's fresh water, out in the ocean. I'll leave the link to the video in the description, so check it out. So my, with my typical underlayment and this nice fleece shirt and with this jacket, I'm able to stay nice and warm. Um, all day long, uh, even if it's super windy. Like I said, this is water resistant, uh, not waterproof, but it really does a good job keeping the water out. As you know, most of the times these days I paddle, so I get, I get a lot of water drips from the paddle. And my arm underneath the jacket never ever got wet. So it stayed dry with all the water dripping to my arm, my sleeves. Not only this is a really, really good uh, windproof, it's a very good water repellent as well. You got your pockets on either side. And this pocket is actually uh, one big pocket. So, right there. We have a lot of space right here. And it's got a zipper on either end. So you can keep things in there and even the zipper, I'm not exactly sure if it's, this is actually a waterproof zipper. It kind of looks like those waterproof zippers. I want to say this is more like a water resistant zipper, but it does keep the water out really well. And I show you the vents here, I showed you the, uh, the zipper on the side 
and the sleeve they are nice and snug not too tight it's also got the elastic so easier to put it on and take it off and it stays on pretty snug so when you are paddling the water doesn't run down to your arm it also has a little loop here for your thumb so I think there's an outer shell you can wear on top of this. It also kind of helps uh, keeping your hand warmer. When I'm paddling, I don't like to wear paddling gloves. It just feels weird. I like to, I like to feel the shaft of the paddle and I can still do that um, with my thumbs through the little loop. And the, uh, it's got the built-in face mask. So this face mask is pretty thick, it's fleece material, so it keeps you nice and warm. And of course it's got a hoodie. And it's got a really good size hoodie too, it actually goes over your hat. And it's got the drawstring here, which you can cinch it down. It really really gives you a nice protection. It's also got a little ventilation hole, so it helps with the airflow a little bit so you don't fog up your sunglasses too much. I'm not gonna lie, this does fog up your sunglasses. Even though thin UV protection face mask causes the fog on your sunglasses anyways. Let's talk about the fit. I normally wear size large and uh, but this one is extra large. Not because the jacket runs small. I think it's a true to size. Uh, I'm wearing the extra large just because in case I want to put an um, extra layer underneath uh, I can uh, without the jacket being too snug and believe it or not I do have a pretty broad shoulders can't really tell because I have a, such a big head so this could be a positive or negative for some people but the, uh, the belly section, abdominal section is very roomy so those of you who's got a little bit of extra insulation on your abdominal region, uh, this will fit very well. And I don't think it will matter too much even if you have a skinny waist. You just have roomy space. So I highly recommend this jacket. Like I said, it's $99. Not cheap, but not too expensive. Uh, with all the features and quality, I think it's actually a good deal. Just to clarify, I'm not affiliated with AFCO. My buddy just thought of me and bought this for me with his own money because he's awesome. I'm getting really really hot so I'm gonna have to uh, end this video. So if you have any questions, please comment down below. And once again, thank you for watching. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Stay tuned for more and go outside and enjoy the outdoors.